and I just want to apologize in advance for how awful my hair looks um, in today's video. I am just having not the best weekend. Um, I had a really hard day on Friday. Um, like I had an anxiety attack on Friday. Then it kind of like messed up how I felt like for the whole rest of Friday in the evening and stuff. Then all through Saturday until the evening time. Then I just went out shopping, completely broke my no buy again. Then felt really down on myself about that. And then today, Sunday, I have just been working on schoolwork all day long and I am exhausted. So, um, yeah, my hair is a mess and I just am trying to get through this video because I cannot let myself get behind on this YouTube channel because I got behind on my other YouTube channel because of stuff going on in my personal life that I don't even know how I stayed on top of things on this channel. And like now I feel like everything is just all tumbling down. So like in everything, like not only YouTube, but just like my professional life and yeah, I don't know. My personal life, everything. Um, 2020 and 2021 have taken their toll on me, okay? I'm literally like fighting back tears right now, so I'm so sorry. Um, anyways, let's go ahead and get into this because this channel is supposed to be like my happy place where I can escape from the world for a little while and just spend some time with you guys. So... Um, I am doing a update video on my rolling wax project and my last update I showed you guys the three candles that I finished up and I rolled in three new candles but I didn't show you guys the progress on the candles that I had in the project already so that is what I'm going to be doing today and then I actually am rolling out four unfinished candles to roll in four new candles so we'll do that at the last bit um of the update but without any further ado let's get into updating you guys about my progress so i'm going to take the lids off so that we don't have to worry about any reflecting or anything this one is blueberry pie and you can see on the back the progress i made from december to march which is actually really january to march because um I didn't burn it at all in December so that's my progress with blueberry pie and I also have made a little bit of progress with my strawberry pound cake so on January 22nd I was there on March 1st I'm down to here so I'm going to keep on working on this one as well as blueberry pie this one is blue tide from scentworks and I unfortunately have not made any progress on this one. That line is still from January. So I really need to start making progress on this one. This one is like a fresh, clean, um, not Febreze, but it's like some brand of laundry detergent is what it smells like to me. And so definitely going to get some use out of it in spring, like to represent for spring cleaning or something. Next up is Maple Pancakes from Scentworks and in January I was right there and now in March I'm down to here so I did make a little bit of progress. This one is my second favorite pancake scent because my favorite one is the scent um, Maple Cinnamon Pancakes I think is what it's called or Cinnamon Maple Pancakes from Bath and Body Works, but they didn't bring it back in 2020. So fingers crossed it comes back in 2021. But anyways, that's just my little tangent. This is the progress I made on Maple Pancakes from Scentworks. And then for this next one is White Icing Cinnamon Rolls. And at the very beginning of um, Mar at the very beginning of February, it was all the way to the top and now I've melted it just down to there. So I just burned it one time and yeah, 
I mean, this is a decent candle. It doesn't give a good throw in an open concept, but in my bedroom or something like that, it's decent or like when I'm sitting at my desk. One that does give a really good throw in an open concept, which is really, really surprising to me. Actually, not really because I've had one from this company before and it gave a decent throw in an open concept as well. But I just am so surprised because like, I don't know, you think that these scents would be lighter scents, but they're not. They're actually like pretty strong. So this one is Village Candles Coconut Mint. And this line is where it was at the beginning of the year 2021. Then February 12th, it was right there. And then now March 1st, it's there. And I only burned it one time today. Actually, because I was like, oh, it's about to be March 1st tomorrow. So I really, really need to burn this one at least once to make a little bit of progress. So I'm happy that I did. Okay, give me a second to get the candles that I am rolling out. Okay, so there are four candles that I am rolling out entirely from this project. So um, just for now, like I might roll them back in eventually someday, but just for now I'm rolling them out. So the first one is Yankee Candles Strawberry Buttercream. This one I did make a little bit new progress on, but it's just not pulling out all the way. And um, I just literally pushed down the side to kind of see like where is it now. But um, this one is one that I love to burn when I have company over because it's not really like overpowering or anything. Like you can just smell it when you're just standing right by it. And so I really love to burn it during those times because if someone is like a little bit sensitive to scents or something, then they just can walk away from the candle and they can't smell it. Um, so, but right now, obviously, I am not seeing that many people and no one is coming into my house other than like my immediate family. So there really is not any point in burning this one right now or having it around so I'm just going to roll that one out the next one that I'm rolling out is one that I actually just rolled in so it's kind of dumb but this one is sweet apple from DW home and this one smells so good on cold but literally look at how it's burning Seriously, like the sides never burn. I did look up a video on how to do the tin foiling method and I tried that, it didn't work. I tried rubbing the wicks, it didn't work. Um, it just is having the worst puny wicks ever in the whole entire world. And so I'm actually just going to chop this one up and put it in my um, wax melters, use it as a wax melt. But for right now, I'm just rolling it out because I already have so many wax melts that I don't need to make more at the moment. Um, the next one that I'm rolling out is this one, Goose Creek's North Pole Bakery. And I've literally made no progress on this since January. Um, I'm going to actually save this one until July and then roll it back in because I want to do a Christmas in July. So I just will wait until then. And finally, the last one that I'm rolling out at the moment is Land of Sweets Blueberry Sugar. This is just like a sweet um, candy-ish blueberry scent. And although it's one that I would prefer to use in the spring and summer, I just am not feeling it right now. I'm going through my blueberry pie right now. And so that is getting my dose of blueberry that I need. So I am rolling this one out. And now I'm going to talk to you guys about the four new ones that I'm rolling in, which I'm so excited about because I'm just like bringing on the spring, bringing on the summer. And I cannot wait. I have been so excited for spring and summer ever since January. So 
I've waited a long time. Okay, so the four that I have replacing those four that I'm rolling out are all Bath and Body Works three with candles. And this first one, don't let the season or the packaging fool you. Um, this is Champagne Toast. Mm, I love this scent. It's fruity, it's sweet, it's bubbly. It's so amazing. Um, the keynotes are bubbly champagne, sparkling berries, and sweet orange. This is from the 2019 Candle Day. I obviously have never burned it before. It's all the way at the top. And I am so excited to get to burning this one. Literally this whole holiday season, I did not even burn a champagne toast or melt a champagne toast. And it's one of my favorite scents from Bath & Body Works. So I am just elated to finally start burning it get into the spring and summer um like because of the fruitiness and everything so i'm excited about that then i have bath and body works well i guess i can leave the lid on this one because it's not going to be reflective this is bath and body works cg white sands this one is another one that i have not ever burned and i bought it i think 2019 Oh no, 2020, and the scent notes are fresh cut sugar cane, white nectarine, and sandalwood. Oh, I remember. I ordered this one during coronavirus online, I think. Because I ordered it with another one, too, and the other one got canceled, but now I can't even remember what one it was. It may have been like Island Daydreamer or something, but who knows? I can't remember, so I shouldn't care. And then these next two are recent purchases. So this first one is in Island Margarita. And this is from um, like the first day of SAS. They did $11 and some amount of cents on sale because I didn't shop during Candle Day. So I missed out on the best deal possible, but that's okay. This one I've never melted or burned. And it's so good. It smells like a Hawaiian fruity combination of like pineapple mango it just smells so good it reminds me of this bubble gum that my grandma used to get me and my sister um and the keynotes are sweet mandarin island mango and sea salt so i'm excited about this one and then last but not least what i'm rolling in is clementine sherbert which is um what is it Iced Clementine Sugared Citrus Sweet Vanilla, and this one has never been burned before. It's a brand new candle that I bought, again, during that $11.95 um, sale that they did the first day of Winter SAS 2020. So, yes, that is everything for my candle rolling wa whoa my rolling wax project hopefully you guys enjoyed it let me know what you guys have gotten through so far this year and i am excited to continue to burn these um hopefully i will be able to update you again in april and hopefully i will have made um significant progress on a lot of these i'm trying to make a diligent effort at burning my candles instead of using wax through the month of March um, like that is my goal to focus more on candles than wax I don't know how good I will be at doing that anyways thank you guys so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this video I will see you next time and as always make sure you stay positive till then bye